What's up, Wayne Baron here with darkfakes.net, and we are inside a Camtasia studio. And what we're doing here is that I'm working on a video, and I need to add in either an image or some sort of a keyboard callout. And what you do is that you go in, let's say that you want to add in an image. You go here, you click on, after you choose callouts, you click on this little arrow down here on the right, and it gives you all these options. If you want to add in an image, you click here, then you go in, then you add in an image. Okay, see, that's one way to do it. Or if you want to do something that looks just a little bit better than that, because I didn't realize how bad that looked until just now, you come down here and you choose Control plus V, which is traditional keystrokes. And once you open up that one, you click right here, and in my case, I want to do Windows plus C. You hold down the Windows key, and then you hit the C at the end. And then that right there will enable you to add in that. So whichever uh, combination that you want to do, let's say that you want to do, uh, let's say, Control Alt Delete. Well, let's not do Control Alt Delete. Let's just do uh, Control Shift Z. So you hold down Control, Mass Shift, and then Mass Z. They have to be done in sequences like that. If you just Mass Control, let off from it, then Shift, let off from it, and then hit Z, it's going to add in each one individually. So you got to make sure that you hold down the one that you want to do first, and then you hit it. So like you have to control alt delete. You have you hit control alt and then hit delete, just like you would do in a real world situation. Is how you need to do it inside this edit box. So anyway, this is Wayne Brown, darkfakes.net with a quick Camtasia Studio tip. Y'all have a good one. Bye bye.